Hey everyone, welcome back to Fast Food Friday. Today we're going back to an old favorite. I happen to be 10 pounds over my lifetime goal weight, so in an effort to get that weight down as quickly as possible, I wanna stay as close to zero point foods as possible. So in the fast food world, that usually means a dry, boring salad, no dressing, no croutons, no protein, just plain old vegetables. Fruit is another option if you can find fruit at a fast food place, but that can also be pretty rare. However, not a Chick-fil-A. That's right, we're back at Chick-fil-A for an old favorite standby, chicken! Yes, we're doing grilled chicken breast today. Would you believe I've never had Chick-fil-A's grilled chicken nuggets? So that's what I'm having today. Um, you can get them in eight, six, eight, or 12 count. I am legit, honestly, probably gonna go for the 12 count because I wanna be full and satisfied and I don't wanna have a lot of points. So I wanna be just really I don't want to be stuffed, but I want to be satisfied. So I'm going for the 12 piece. I'm going to use, instead of all of the sauces they have, I'm going to use mustard as a dipping sauce because mustard is zero smart points. You can also use, if you want to bring your sauce from home, you can bring the G Hughes sugar-free barbecue sauce that you can get at Walmart. And you can have three tablespoons of G Hughes sugar-free barbecue sauce for zero points. Or you can have nine tablespoons of G Hughes sugar-free barbecue sauce for one smart point. So that makes a great dipping option and that's what I use a lot of times to dip my chicken in when I'm at home. However, today I'm going to use mustard because a lot of the packets at Chick-fil-A have a lot of points. This is where your points really add up if you are having chicken. It's okay to have whatever sauce you want as long as you can work those points into your budget. I'm choosing to stay as low as possible on points today. The lowest point sauce is the buffalo sauce for one smart point per packet. The highest sauces are the Polynesian sauce and the Chick-fil-A sauce, both really delicious and both have six smart points per packet. Who stops at one packet? So yeah, those sauces are really good, but if you're choosing the Polynesian or the Chick-fil-A, they can really add up fast. So I'm also going to have with my Chick-fil-A grilled chicken nuggets, I'm going to have the fruit cup. I'll probably get a medium fruit cup, fruit cup, <laughs> because that seems to be a good amount without being too much fruit. Um, the fruit cup is one smart point and I reasoned with myself last time I was here, the one smart point is probably because of the mandarin oranges that they use in the fruit cup. They are probably canned, which means they have a little bit of sugar in them. So I'm going to have that. I'm gonna have a fruit cup, grilled chicken nuggets, and a diet soda all for one smart point. Let's go order. Okay, there's actually no drive up at this Chick-fil-A, which is a little odd to me, um, but I'm gonna go ahead and go in and order. I don't expect this to be a very inexpensive meal. To me, Chick-fil-A is pretty pricey. It's really delicious, and I love the fact that it's almost no smart points, but you do pay for that convenience. Um, so <laughs> I'm gonna go in and see what the price is for 12 grilled chicken nuggets and a medium fruit cup and a small soda. Okay, I knew this wasn't gonna be cheap, but I don't know if I expected $13.29. I actually ended up getting the meal. You get the meal, I believe the grilled chicken nugget meal for 12 pieces was 10 something, but in order to substitute the fruit cup, I had to add an extra two something. Um, so here's my fruit cup. I believe this is a medium fruit cup. They didn't give me a choice on the size. Here's the fruit cup and it does have the mandarin oranges in it. So that's, I'm guessing why the fruit cup is one smart point. And the grilled chicken nuggets must be tiny because this is 12 grilled nuggets. I'm really glad I got the 12 piece. I have mustard here for dipping and let's get after it. Yeah, these are tiny little chicken nuggets. I guess because there's no breading, when you bread chicken, it kind of adds to the volume. I got, I got 10 packs of mustard and seeing the size of the chicken nuggets, I don't think I'm gonna need 10 packs. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. Let's have a sample. Let me show you how big these guys are. Ooh, they're hot. That's good. I also got plenty of napkins. All right, let's start 
Let's start instead with the fruit cup because these chicken nuggets are hot. The fruit cup is gonna taste like fruit. I'll tell you that there are blueberries, strawberries, uh, honeydew, I think that's honeydew, and some apple, and the mandarin oranges. Here's what the fruit looks like. Mmm. Let's go with an orange and a strawberry. Mmm. Very good and very fresh. And it's not honeydew, it's apple, green apple. Mmm. Chick fil A, I give you an A plus on the fruit cup. Now let's try the chicken or the fork. Here's the size of the chicken nuggets. Okay, it looks big when I do that, when I put it next to my mouth. <laughs> it's not that big, but it's chicken, right? So it's gonna be satisfying and filling. I'm having a little mustard with my chicken. Mmm. That was really good. The chicken is not dry at all. In fact, it's pretty moist. I wonder how they cook it so well. It almost looks like um, dark skin chicken, but it's not, it's chicken breast, and it's just cooked very well so that it's not dry at all. I'm enjoying this. Mmm. I also, love the flavor of the mustard. <laughs> it's French as mustard. But what can I say? I love mustard. Okay, so let's rate these bad boys. Chick-fil-A, I give you an A plus for food. These chicken nuggets are delicious. They're filling. They're not dry. They taste awesome. And the fruit cup is very, very fresh and it has just the right amount of tart and sweet. It's perfect. So Chick-fil-A, I give you an A plus for food. Now about the price, we need to talk. <laughs> I don't think I would spend $13.29 for lunch very often, maybe once a week, but it's pretty pricey for just chicken and fruit and a soda. I did get my Diet Coke, by the way. So what I'm really most happy about is that I have a complete full meal for one smart point. So to me, that is probably worth $13, not on a regular basis, but today, trying to drop the weight, one smart point for a full and complete lunch, $13.29, it works for me. So thanks Chick-fil-A, thanks you guys. If you have any place that you want me to go, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see if I have one in my neighborhood. Thanks for all the uh, suggestions so far. I think we might do burgers again next week, so stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys next time on Fast Food Friday.